Hey guys, welcome back to The Game Replay. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Final Fantasy X 2 HD Remaster for the Sony PlayStation 3. Man, feels like I've been doing this a long time. Okay, so let's just get to it. I hope to finish it up in this part. Wanna check the comm spheres? At least the, the first time around. Like I said, we're gonna be doing comm sphere stuff again a little later on. Uh, so, okay, where were we? Beaconel Desert? Bavel? Comlands! We're at the Comlands! Okay, we have a couple places here. I'm gonna go to the travel agency first. There's a couple of things to do and, and view at the travel agency. None, none of them give you percentage, so don't worry about it. Good stuff. Just enjoy. Thanks, about time. Okay, so, uh, oh man. That dork, awkward dork, and his awkward old man. Don't know what that means, but keep at it. If not me, if not for me, then for my son. Father Zook, is that you? Man, Father Zook, I think that's him. I'm gonna say that that is Father Zook. You know, we saw him once at the Comlands. That looks exactly like him. Come on, that's gotta be him. Father Zook's so weird. I talked about that character in Final Fantasy X. I just thought it was a little weird that this guy just he just walks out of nowhere. We haven't seen him before, haven't talked him haven't talked about him or made reference, anything like that. And then he just disappears and that's it forever. Yeah, you can look up about the minor character of Father Zook. And, uh, I think there are, like, a couple of appearances by him. You know, none 100%, none totally confirmed, but I should back out of here. Um, yeah, it's never been confirmed, but, like, yeah, his, his, um, but, yeah, his appearance has appeared throughout uh, portions of this game. And even Final Fantasy X. I mean, sometimes, like, uh, they'll take a certain character and recolor him so he looks, like, semi-different, right? They do that for some characters. So I believe uh, we see customers coming and going once more. Uh, if we exit back out, then we can get to a couple of different things. But yeah, just customers coming, going. What if uh, this happened while we were like out and about and we wanted to buy items? Let's say we had to wait in line because like this was happening and I wanted to buy some items. You know, that actually did occur though. Isn't that funny? It occurred at Jose Temple. And we had to actually wait in that line. Isn't that weird? Okay, so something new this time. Oh my, someone's in a hurry this time. Oh, look who's up from his seat. It's the weird kid. He's awkward and goofy. What's his deal? <laughs> oh, what a loser. What's she doing? What's she talking to him about? Uh, I guess she's not interested? Hmm, I wonder what that was. I don't know. Uh, okay, so that happened. The, uh, the old man's consoling his kid because the kid's a failure. A failure. A big, fat failure. That's a shame. Other than that, I guess it's, uh, other than that, guess it's the same old, same old. So, we're out of here. But we're gonna go back. Two more times, I believe. Yeah, Chocobo Ranch, you saw that. Remember, uh, Shinra put a comm sphere in there. We're gonna check 
on Clasco. Oh boy, that's gonna be something, right? Oh boy. Hey! What does this guy do all day? Why are they even here at the travel agency to begin with? Where are you going? Oh! Interesting. He's, uh... I believe he's getting his money and he's just taken off and he's gonna ditch his son forever. No, actually what he's doing is he's hiding money in the chest and we can acquire it. And, uh, I believe it's a lot. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with taking free money in a video game. I'll do it. Okay, so that's all. Oh, wait. What do they talk to him about? I don't know. Eh, oh well. There you go. So we can witness one more scene here. At the travel agency. There we are. Oh, that kid. The goofy kid who has no bride. What a mutt. What a mutt. Whoa! Whoa! That was tasteless. Huh. Okay. So, uh, yeah, now we only have one location. That comm sphere is gone. Uh, okay, so now we're off to the uh, Comland Chocobo Ranch for several scenes. Um, if we had not captured a Chocobo at this point, um, a couple things would be different. Out of all several of the scenes to witness and view, uh, only one will give you a little bit of the percentage. I'll let you know which one that is. Yeah, I believe it's a good thing we caught one. Otherwise, I think we might have missed out on this. If we didn't catch one, Clasco would just be shaking his head and pointing a gun at himself. You're a good boy, aren't you? Good boy. Oh, yes, you are. So I guess that's it for this scene. It's kind of just recycled, really. Okay, and now for the important one. This right here, this coming up scene, uh, will give you a little bit of that percentage. Glasgow. I don't know where he is. Is he over here? <laughs> no. Oh. It's been a while since we've seen Lady Yuna. Hello. Lady Yuna? We won't be able to visit you for a while. Are the Chocobos doing okay? Take care of them. Of course. Hope to see you sometime soon. So other than that, there's just two more scenes you can view here that are just pretty minor, and I don't think Clasco does much more. He might talk a little more. Yeah, that could be it.
So yeah, had we not captured a Chocobo, that wouldn't go too well. Clasco would just be standing there and, you know, grabbing his head and freaking out, you know, same old, same old, right? Hmm. It was supposed to be slightly different. I wonder why it doesn't change up. I'm kind of, I mean, I'm kind of interested. How many times do you have to view the, the same thing? Go on, show me, do it. Huh? Eh? Oh, well, that's pretty much it then. There's something about this scene that's Almost awkward. All right, folks, off to our next location. It's gonna be Mount Gagazet. There's actually not too much to do here. There's only like two scenes. One will give you a little bit of the percentage, and that one is the first scene. Depending on how you help the Ronso, uh, this and that, Kamari's conversation with Yuna uh, could, end, could end up differently. But yeah, we're gonna go to the mountain gate, talk to Kamari. That'll give us a little percentage, we'll check back, and then we'll go to the next area. Good stuff. Hey, Kamari! I'm going to be in a concert! Bring the rest of the Ronso and come watch! Kimari cannot. Elder Kimari have duty. Kimari cannot leave mountain. That's too bad. I really wanted you to come listen. Kimari listen. Song join hearts. Yuna sing from heart. Kimari hear Yuna's song. Kimari believe this. You're right. You're right. I'll do my best, Kamari. So I suppose Kamari is in okay spirits. Nothing too bad going on here. So I guess that's it. <laughs> Kamari. Ah, uh, interesting role for him in this game, huh? So yeah, that right there was the important scene. If we go back, one other scene can happen at the Mountain Gate. We'll go watch that now. Oh my! <laughs> you know, even... Even the leader of the Ronso gets... Well, actually, he should get stressed. Actually, Kamari's had a lot of stress. All his fellow Ronso are, are assholes. I mean, come on, man. This guy, yeah. You deserve it, Kamari. You deserve that back rub. You deserve that back massage. Eh, still, it's kind of funny. So, yeah, uh, the female Ronso, Kamari's woman. Kamari's woman. Giving him a back rub. That's, uh, yeah, that's all. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. So, folks, now we're off to, uh, uh, you know, I believe it's our last location right now. There's nothing to do at Xanarkin. I'll find out. Uh, the comm sphere might not work at this time currently. But now we're off to the hot springs, and, uh, this is pretty much the biggest, craziest place to have like the most viewings there's like at least a dozen uh and yeah you definitely need a guide for this because there's like going to be a couple that don't mean anything and then there's going to be one that counts for a little bit of percentage and then there's just going to be one for nothing then one for some more percentage a couple for none and then a couple for some and none none some some okay and it goes on like that so yeah it's all scattered about and it's a big pain and, uh, yeah, let's just get to it. We're going to the Hot Springs. Yeah, the Hot Springs in, uh, Mount Gagazette. Oh, dear. 
I'm sure nothing hilarious and crazy and odd and weird, all the above, is about to happen at this place. And of course, I'll let you know if it's an important scene. Hot springs. Hot tubbin. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this guy. You know, the Ronso, they have a good location. I think they kept this place a secret for a long time too, you know, up until Sin was defeated. Yeah, a secret mountain. Gagazette, not changed for 1,000 years. Ah, uh, yeah, now if you'll excuse me, I'm just gonna go around the corner. <sighs> Maybe grudge melt away here. Yeah, gonna relax in my private hot spring, ah. Uh. These punks, man, they hid that from us. We had to wait a little while there, didn't we? Why is he sitting like that? It just doesn't seem comfortable. It looks like he's about to get ready for the next play in a football game. Yep. Eh, that could be it. I will also say that I've never heard a Ronso sound like that. It's kind of unusual. Maybe because he's in the hot spring. Maybe that's what they sound like while they're doing this. You know, they're just no more tension, no more anger, no more hostility, testosterone. It's just, it's all mellow. Hey, who knows? Maybe that's why they did that. Had the voice sound like that. No, I, I don't think so. Okay, so enough of that. We'll go back uh, for another scene. It's gonna be many, one of many. Giddy up! <gasps> Here of all places! All right, how about that? Gektar! I suppose that's why we couldn't find them all, you know, in chapter four. I couldn't do them all. Oh, man. Okay, well, that's all for this scene. And now comes one of the important ones. This upcoming scene counts for a little bit of the percentage, so now you know. It's, it must be an important scene then, right? It must be very important. Yep, it's gonna be very important. Okay. What are they doing back there? Oh, and, th and then they leave. So that was... That scene was crucial. The end. Okay, and now it's time for just a couple of random scenes. These aren't crucial. That's odd. What? What am I looking at? What are those? Wait. Could they be? High pillow. T the tops of the heads.
This is the most frightening thing I have ever witnessed in any game ever! Dear God! Oh no. Yeah, guys, I just, uh, yeah. I just totally pissed myself. It was the fear! Oh man. Okay, well, I'll worry about that later. Done with that scene. Urine everywhere. Probably a, you know, speaking of urine, probably a lot of urine in that hot spring. I mean, come on, man. Hey, have you ever peed in the pool? Have you ever peed in the shower? Are you man enough to admit it? In my video? In the, in the discussion? Below? Am I man enough to admit it? Yep. All right, next scene. <laughs> Good stuff. Good stuff? Hmm. Hey, oh, isn't this nice? It's shoe puffs. I like shoe puffs. They're they're decent people. Shoe puffs are decent people. It would be really cool if we could see the, well, I guess that wouldn't make much sense. If you saw the uh, jacked shoe puff, but how would that one end up here? That one's all the way at the uh, moon flow. Bet you didn't see this coming. Then again, people travel from point A to point B rather quickly in this game sometimes. There's been examples and there will be examples. Hello, Shoe Puff. Yes, I see you. You got a face? Okay, cool. Oh, eyes. Right, right. Uh, and, uh, that thing right there. Okay. Yeah. That's awesome. See you later. the problem, you know? Like, what are you expecting? What are you expecting? An orgy? Let the man swim. He's doing the breaststroke. Okay, folks, the following two viewings, two viewings, uh, that will give you some percentage. So these next two, important. IMPORTANT! Oh, uh, oh my god! Bobby! That felt good. Oh, dear God. Wow, automatic cutoff? How did he get there? So, uh, where to, kids? What the hell? And like the whole thing was broken up. It's there was another scene following, and I'm like out of the the com sphere menu. I, uh, okay. Next stop, the moon flow. Sorry, kids. No time for side trips. Hang on a sec. I need to watch more perverted scenes at the uh, at the Gagazet Hot Springs. <laughs> what was that? Want to check the com spheres? Oh, what was that? Yeah, um... So, where was I? Okay, this next scene, this next viewing at Mount Gagazet's gonna be an important one as well. So why don't we check it out? Welcome to the Wonka's. 
something. I think you're not. The last one, best one, definitely. The singing one. Do the singing one, Awaka. I like how Awaka doesn't have a shirt on, but he still has uh, the the hat and the backpack and the little arm things. All right, we're done. So the next viewing doesn't give us any percentage. After that, three in a row will give us some percentage. That's uh, them again. Kind of weird. Stop. Why is it synchronized? Stop doing that. Ugh. Once. Oh, it's the way he was like trying to look over. Yeah, look, he's like, eh, no, no. Wants is spying on girls. Oops. Hmm. <laughs> I guess Wants took a tumble. Wants was doing some spying. What is the movement? It's so... Ah, uh, facepalm. Okay, so like I said, the next three viewings are important, and the next three give you some percentage. So let's do it. It's time to do it. And then after that, there's more. There's a lot here. It's the Hot Springs. Gee, the most viewings here at the Hot Springs? Who would have thought? How's life treating you, Asaru? Same as always. With you, it's always same as always, isn't it? Hey, did you guys hear? Lady Yuna's a spear hunter now. The fact that I don't change is one of my better assets. Can't you accept that? Um, what's an asset? Do I have a asset too? Asset? Only other people can tell you what your assets are. They're not something you can judge on your own. Baroda, may I have a word with you? What? So, it's an Isaru Maroda Passe reunion. Isn't that fun? Isn't that nice? Okay, the music got a little louder, and the scene concluded. So we can back out. But yeah, there are, there are two more important ones in a row here still. Let's get to them. doing these days? I don't know. Why would I know what he's up to? Uh, I hope he's all right. I'm sure he's off somewhere gushing about how much he loves his good little chocobo. <laughs> well, maybe he's closer than we think. So Elma and Lucille discuss Clasco and his chocobo. I guess that's, I guess that's all. Uh, Okie dokie. So on to another important scene for another little, little bit of percentage. Sacred 
said about Gagazet. The permanence of this place is palpable. Care to hear about it? <laughs> That's awesome. Machen is trying to discuss uh, spirit history with uh, a monkey. That's funny. That's comical. That's a fun little scene. So that was uh, that was three out of three important ones in a row. Okay. I believe there are four uh, scenes left here. Yeah, four more, and two are important at the hot springs. So let's go back. This one is not. This one's not important. Three guesses who's gonna be in it. This is the life. Oh, relaxing with a chocobo. I just wanna sit here doing nothing. Every time I try to do something, it ends up going wrong. Ah, maybe I can get through life without doing anything at all. Wait for me! Clasco, dear God. All right. So that only would have happened had we captured a chocobo before the end of chapter three, which I did, so there you go. All right, folks, the, the following next two viewings uh, are important for a little bit of percentage. So, here we go. I tell you, sometimes I just don't know what gets into them kids these days, you know? Letting themselves get all bit out of shape up over the <laughs> tiniest little thing. Mm. Oh, not everyone who gets bent out of shape is a kid. <clears throat> if you know what I mean. Just whose side are you on, anyway? You're not so young yourself, Missy. <laughs> About time you started acting your age. Sid. I bet we could start quite a business here at the Springs. We'll make a fortune. We could finally rebuild home. Why build a home the Elbed no longer need? What in tarnation? So just what have you been saving up all that gill for? I have decided I want my own home. That is what I am working for now. Rian. Listen, Sid. It might be cliche, but times really are changing. Even if you rebuilt home, no one would come. People are too busy looking for a new place to belong. And Sid returns underneath the water, sulking. Sid, he's pretty much been sulking the entire time we've seen him throughout the game. I don't know, he's just having a hard time, I guess, moving on with this new world, you know? He's used to... Oh, Rin left. He's used to uh, a world with uh, everyone else in the Albed. Everyone else, Albed, Sin. Rin, on the other hand, he's adjusting pretty fine. So there you go, folks. So like I said, uh, these two were important, uh, just like this next one. So this will be uh, another important one for another piece of the percentage pie. Who are we gonna be seeing? We've se we've seen like everyone. Who's left to see? My, my. <sighs> it's 
just no fun all alone. Yeah, I guess her and Bartello still at uh, still at odds. Oh, she's still there. But I believe the scene is over. What is she doing? Hmm. You know what? Is it just me or, or is it just me or has the water gotten like more uh, uh, white? You know, not as you know you can't see through it. Like, uh, like before. Remember when that dude was swimming around? You could see his, like, legs and, you know, whatnot. Him swimming, fully. <laughs> when did that change? I'm so interested in knowing now. Because you could, used to see, like, the whole person's body. Then again, you know, it might have changed over time. I don't know, I just actually didn't notice until right now. Hmm, okay, well, whatever. That's all, folks. Uh, we can view it one more time, but I believe the hot springs at this point will now be empty, and that's a wrap, folks. That is a wrap! Oh, man, we did it! I'm gonna point out something real quick. I did all of the Comsphere stuff, all of it, in one sitting. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much the majority of this chapter. Wait, what's that? <gasps> Uh, no, nothing. I'm just kidding. Okay, so that's it. Nothing left at the hot springs. Eh, good times, man. Good times. And that's all that is listed for me. I'm pretty sure that means if we try and view uh, anything at the Xander can ruin comm sphere that we don't get a signal. Why don't we go and find out? Real quick, we'll go check it out. It's probably not working, though. Right now. At the moment. Let's see. Well, it's working. People are gathered here. Hmm. A little weird. This isn't listed for me. Well, now I have to check this out for like two minutes just to make sure. People are gathered by the fire, the little small fire that never burns out. It's always there, and it's always in the same exact location. Is there like a, a bulletin somewhere? If you start fires, make sure to do it here, not there. There. It's important. So yeah, I'm zooming in. I'm scanning around. Hmm, I wouldn't be surprised to see Asaru here. Uh, I think the important Xanarkin stuff happens a little later. Maybe that's why it's not included. Probably why it's not included in my list. Because I think every place we've seen, at least one of the viewings has been important. Actually, that's not true. Like the moon flow. Hmm. So, go figure, folks. I'm gonna view one more time. Just to make sure. And then we're gonna call it a wrap and we are done with the comm sphere viewing. That's right, folks. No more comm sphere viewing. Uh, until a little later. <laughs> and then... It's gonna be just as long, if not longer. But like I said, I actually kinda like the comm sphere stuff. This game, like I, I stated before, this is not a Final Fantasy X game. This is a Final Fantasy X-2 game, you know? It, there, it's, a, it's a bit different. It's not your typical, same old Final Fantasy game. It's a sequel game. You gotta take it for what it is. Okay, I don't think there's anything... Uh, going on right here right now at the Xanarkin Ruins. So that's it folks. You know, I'm actually gonna call it a wrap while I'm viewing the the Xanarkin Comsphere. Good stuff folks. Okay, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Of course, leave me those comments and tell me what you think. 
Oh, I accidentally backed out. That that ruined everything. Man, that ruined it all. That ruined my my sign off. I'm gonna have to scrap the part. I'm gonna have to scrap the part. <laughs> my dog's looking at me. Even he knows. Bailey, my outro is kind of is kind of stained there a little bit. Anyway, folks, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter. Links are in the description. I like these Comsphere parts. We can get a little wacky. Uh, come over to my Facebook page and say hello, man. There's been my Facebook page. I gotta tell you, it's been pretty crazy lately, and it's been it's been some fun times. Awesome stuff. I'm Dave the Usher for the Game Replay. Stay tuned for the next part of Final Fantasy X 2 HD Remaster. I'll see you guys next time. I am out.